I promise. I know you're not. You don't like the public, but I want everybody to know that you're here. I just hate people. I just hate people. Well, say that's one of those guys that just hates people. When's your next fight? Uh, we're looking at about October, November sometime with back and forth to it. We're going to my, my reservation in church in North Carolina. You're fighting over your own, own grounds, right? Yeah, yeah, it's going to my reservation, so anybody that want to put up against me on my reservation, let's go. Bring it on. I know, you're kind of like Spencer Fisher, it don't matter who comes to the ring, you're just there to fight, right? I just never up and showed up. That's the game. What did you do to one of our guys, Zach Cash? Were you kind of buffing him up a little bit or what? I seen his eye on Facebook. Uh, what happened there? Um, that was a technical error on his part. He ducked into my leg kick. So we'll, we'll work on that. All right. Hey, thanks for coming and I'm looking forward to Colorado tomorrow. You're fighting a tough guy from Springfield. I'm not going to say win or lose. I'm just telling you you're fighting a good guy from Springfield. He's got good sportsmanship. He's got a good ground game. But I also seen your guy in Danville. I announced that show, and uh, that guy's awesome. How many fights has Connor had? Uh, Connor's got over 11 bouts under his belt, so it, it's going to be a good bout. I'm definitely ready for it. Really for it I, I was really impressed with uh, some of the uh, holes he got out of over in Danville on the ground. Uh, was that was that his training partner he was fighting? No, that was a uh, guy from uh, Springfield, Missouri. But either way, it's, yeah, he's, he's got a real good ground game. Um, I just noticed that uh, he can get out without anything. He's like a worm. And, uh, anyway, I'll not keep you up here. You hate people. I don't want you to hate me, and I don't want my eyes sold up like uh, Zach. So uh, good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Dan Hornbuckle. He'll be fighting.